हेलो स्टूडेंट हाउ आर यू आई एम योर टीचर सुनील वाई सर थर्ड ईयर बी कॉम टॉपिक इन्वेस्टमेंट अकाउंटिंग ओके दिस इज एन फर्स्ट लेक्चर ऑन इन्वेस्टमेंट अकाउंट दिस इज अ इंट्रोडक्टरी लेक्चर लेट अस स्टार्ट विद द वर्ड इन्वेस्टमेंट वी नो अकाउंट स्टार्ट विद द वर्ड इन्वेस्टमेंट वी हर्ड दिस वर्ड सो मेनी टाइम इन्वेस्टमेंट 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 नाउ डे दिस इज अ बजिंग वर्ड इन द कॉर्पोरेट वर्ल्ड दिस इज एन इन्वेस्टमेंट एवरी वन इज टॉकिंग अबाउट इन्वेस्टमेंट सो इफ वी थिंक अबाउट इन्वेस्टमेंट वी केम टू नो देर आर अ टू एंगल देर आर टू एंगल अबाउट इन्वेस्टमेंट सम पीपल से इन्वेस्टमेंट मीन्स नथिंग बट द मनी इन्वेस्टेड इन टू द बिजनेस दिस इज एन इन्वेस्टमेंट रफली और ऑन ग्रॉस लेवल इफ वी थिंक इन्वेस्टमेंट वट इज इन्वेस्टमेंट इन्वेस्टमेंट मीन्स मनी इन्वेस्टेड इन टू द बिजनेस दिस इज एन इन्वेस्टमेंट इट इज ट्राई टू अंडरस्टैंड वॉट इज इन्वेस्टमेंट द कॉन्सेप्ट द फर्स्ट पर्सन और फर्स्ट एंगल द इन्वेस्टमेंट इज वॉट द मनी द मनी which invested into the business this is an also investment suppose a money invested into the manufacturing business this is an also investment suppose money invested into the trading business buy and sell this is also investment and suppose the money invested into the service business service business the business which render the services to the people or to the consumer so this is an also business after investing this type of business businessmen enjoy profit do you getting me after investing money into this side entrepreneur or we can say businessmen enjoy profit for that we prepare financial accounts profit and loss account trading account and balance sheet okay now come to this side this is a first angle now what is the second angle the second angle is that the money invested into the securities money invested into securities this is an also investment not in business not in this sector but money invested into the business that business already established the, that business is already going concern and the investors invest into the securities like government bonds you studied this in a sp secretarial practice 12th standard so money invested into the government bonds money invested into the shares equity shares or preference shares every day we heard this about uh, ups and downs in the prices of shares reliance axis bank hdfc tata motors and so many companies there so money invested into the shares of particular company this is an invested and again also money invested into the debentures you studied the, this the concept debenture in sp also and in second year become corporate accounting also after that suppose money invested into the mutual funds this is also an investment so i hope you understand first two angle of investment first angle that is this money invested into the business own business money invested into the own business the business like manufacturing concern trading concern or service concern after investing money into this type of business businessmen will enjoy profit second angle the money invested into the already set business or already established business already going concern business money invested into government bonds shares debentures or mutual fund after money investing these type of business investors enjoy interest what here he enjoy profit here he enjoy interest or dividend i think no need to explain what is dividend what is interest you already know this okay so in this chapter we have to deal with these types of businesses or these types of activity suppose mr sunil bhai sir invested into shares suppose mr sunil bhai sir invested into debentures or government bond 
student has to kept account about these activities not these activities in this chapter we have to deal with this now come here types of securities as i told you money invested into these types of security government bonds shares debenture mutual funds like this types of securities generally there are two types of security the first fixed yield security the security which yield fixed income over a year or over a time this is known as a fixed yield security for example uh, debentures having fixed rate of interest 6% per annum per annum so this is an this is an fixed yield securities preference shares 8% preference shares so what is 8% preference shares 8% means the rate of dividend on these shares or 6% debenture means the rate of interest that investors will receive okay fixed yield securities after that viable yield securities in opposition that inverse on the other hand what is viable yield security means the securities like uh, shares where the dividend is not a fix which vary year to year which vary quarter to quarter there is a no fix rate of interest or there is a no fix rate of dividend which is changing which changing why because there are so many factors so many factors which affect the rate of return such as the political condition of the country then economical condition of the country ups and downs hmm? prosperity recession growth then politic uh, legal position in the country suppose there is any amendment in the corporate law there is any introduction of the new law which affect the viable yield security so so many factors natural factors social factor economical factor political factor legal factor even though technical factors also affect the rate of return on such a security so this is known as a viable yield securities okay now the question what student has to do in this chapter what is the responsibility of the student so responsibility of the student is to prepare investment account kya karna hai student ko is chapter mein student has to prepare investment account and which is very 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 simple okay i will now i will explain what is the investment account now my first question to you what is which investment account is a which type of account if you know this investment account is a which type of account whether it is a personal account whether it is a real account or whether it is a nominal account if you know this there then there is no need to explain the meaning and how to pass the general entry and how to how to post the transaction if you know this you will get answer so which type of account is this investment account is this yes 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 investment account is a real account investment account is a real account as like any other asset as like any other asset it is a investment account and what we do when we purchase asset we debit it suppose i purchase a uh, machinery what will be the my entry machinery account debit to bank right suppose i sell machinery what will be the my entry cash account debit to machinery so as like any asset as like any asset investment is also asset okay so investment account ledger i am talking about ledger two side debit side credit side whenever investor purchase the investment debit it right whenever investors purchase the investment debit it or whenever investor sell the asset credit it so there are column date column then particular column then capital column cost column interest or dividend column and same column on the credit side also i will 
explain in detail when we when we uh, go to solve the problem now you have to understand these types of security freely bought and sold on the stock exchange why to need to maintain this account because such a types of investment freely bought and sold on the stock exchange that's why the investor needs to prepare the account now objective what are the objectives to keep this investment account or to maintain this investment account the first objective to find out profit and loss from each kind of security in which he is dealing suppose i am investor and i am dealing in different securities suppose i am purchasing shares of tata motors suppose i also purchase debentures suppose i sell uh, shares which i already purchased uh, of um, reliance industries so investors need to understand profit and loss from each kind of securities okay that's why need to keep investment account second to help the investors in decision making which what happened that investor has to take decision if he is continuously facing if he continuously suffering losses from particular security then he will decide to sell it okay then how he will decide on the basis of investment account so for decision making process investors needs to maintain investment account and last one to ascertain income receivable or received during the year the net income received from particular security or the receivable income from particular security investors need to investors need to maintain this account i hope you understand this have a small revision then we'll go next investment what is investment money invested into the business this is an investment two angle two concept two corner the first corner money invested into the business like a manufacturing trading service after investing money into this business businessmen enjoy profit second angle second corner second concept second hand investment means the money invested into the security the already set up business in that suppose investor invested his money this is an investment like money invested into government bond security debenture mutual fund after investing this type of security businessmen or that investors enjoy interest or dividend or this fixed yield variable yield and like this okay i hope you understand this in the next lecture we will uh, i will explain the very important concept this is a specimen of investment account and then two very 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 important concept that is the ex interest come interest and fipo method and market valuation method without understanding this you will not able to solve the problem of investment account i am again appeal you i already provide notes on the google classroom okay so go through it and scope this note with the lecture take care bye bye